All right, fans, welcome back. Tag team grudge match on going on right here on Livewire. And right now we see the brothers, Dustin and Steven, going at it here. During the break, it was just total chaos. Referee actually had to intervene and threaten to disqualify both of these teams. This matchup has just been out of control from opening bell. Here we go now, Stephen Clark here, trying to turn things around on his brother. British kid right there trying to break it up, but did not work. And here we go now, this is not looking good. Oh my God, top row back body drop delivered by Stephen onto his older brother Dustin. And now Stephen rushing over to make the tag to Silas Mark. Now Silas on the attack of Dustin. Dustin went for a clothesline. Silas Mark ducks underneath. There's the Drops down, and now he goes behind Silas here, and here we go, a couple of forearms in between the shoulder blades of Silas Marks now. Now Dustin Clark here with a swinging neck breaker onto the leader of Society X. And Dustin Clark trying to get the fans into this matchup here. He whips Silas into the ropes now. Silas goes down once again. Dustin Clark in total control of the matchup right now. He's going to whip Silas into the other corner. Here we go, here's a tag to the British Kid now. We're going to see a little bit of tag team action here. Dustin Clark dropped toe hold, followed by an elbow to the back of the head, delivered by the British Kid on to Silas Mark. And I tell you, fans, this matchup is just unbelievable here. And this is just half of it. I mean, next week on Livewire, it will be the British Kid taking on Stephen Clark for the Cruiserweight Championship. And this has also been confirmed for Crashdown. It will be Dustin Clark taking on his younger brother, Stephen Clark, at Crashdown. The only question is, will that match be for the Cruiserweight Championship? It all depends on whether or not the British Kid can beat Stephen. And now Dustin Clark here. He's still working on Silas Mark. There's a swinging neck breaker. And now Dustin going up top here. Taking too much time, I think. Silas Marks gets back to his feet. He gets caught in the face with a missile drop kick. And now look at Dustin Clark. He's starting to feel it. Here's another swinging neck breaker on the Silas. Now Dustin, once he got the land here, rushes in. Oh, man, and Silas Marks playing possum. and just caught Dustin out of nowhere with a huge clothesline, followed by a double axe handle to the back of the head. Now Steven, he wants to get to the matchup, of course, now that his brother's taken down, but he allows his brother to get back up here. And I tell you, this, this heat between Steven and Dustin is just unbelievable. I can just not imagine what their matchup at Crashdown is going to look out. I mean, these guys are their brothers. They grew up together. They know each other better than anyone else. Well, like I said, I mean, look at this. It's like one of them will do a move, the other one will reverse it. I mean, they, the guys, they, they're so parallel to one another. They know each other so well. Now Dustin here, he's got Steven locked in a submission. Is Steven going to tap here? Steven powering his way out, able to get out of the move here. Now Steven trying to get in control of the matchup. And Dustin Clark catches him with a discus style clothesline. Now look at this, Dustin working on his younger brother Steven. Stomping away now on him. British kid right behind him. Here we go, here's the roll up. This could do it here. No, Steven Clark just powers out. And sends his older brother across the ring now. Steven trying to gain the upper hand here, get control of this matchup. There's a swinging neck breaker delivered by Steven Clark. And now Steven Clark, what's he got playing here? Justin Clark trying to get some advantage. There's an insecurity to the back of the head of Steven. Now Steven a little bit wobbly on his feet, but he is able to catch Justin who rushed in. And there, oh my God, man, this action is so fast paced. It's hard for me to keep up. Dustin Clark tried another roll-up. Steven kicked him away here. There's the collar and elbow tie-up. Dustin's going to drag Steven into the corner here. Or tried to, at least. Steven's able to get away now. Dustin's got a hold of him again. Here's a tag by the British Kid. Now the British Kid and Steven double drop kick. And look at this. Dustin using the British Kid here for added leverage. Leg drop right across the throat of Steven. And here we go. Here's a standing back somersault flip flash thing, if you will. Here's the cover. This could do it here. And, oh, man! Silas Marks in at the last possible second to break that up. I mean, you have to believe that that was going to be it now. Now Dustin is just knocked Steven off of the apron here. We see Steven Clark and Silas, or Steven Clark and British Kid now, outside the ring. Now Dustin, he's going to rush over here, and he 
going after Steven. Steven takes Rich Kid back into the ring. Dustin climbing up top. What's he going to do here? Steven Clark's on the apron. Dustin left off. I guess he overcalculated because he totally missed it here. And look at that. Did you see that? Steven just took out the ref now. No referee right now. And look, wait a minute now. Dustin Clark's got a two by four. And he just took Steven, or took out Silas Marks with that two by four while the referee was down. Oh my God. Unbelievable here now. That was unreal. I mean, that's actually kind of shocking here. Questionable tactic by Dustin Clark. Now the British kid chopping away on Steven here in the corner. And this could be just a small preview of what to expect next week when the British kid takes on Stephen Clark for the Cruiserweight title. And now the British kid with another cover opportunity here trying to get to win the match as Stephen Clark kicks out. I tell you, this has been an incredible matchup here. Lots of back and forth action. Hard to really just call and decide who's going to win here. Now, Justin Clark, he's outside the ring now. Stephen Clark going back out to his corner. And British kid in total control here with a kick to the back of Stephen. Dustin Clark wants the end. And now British Kid finally tags him in. Dustin Clark now. He's in the matchup. Steven gets back to his feet here. Wait a minute now. Steven now with a quick, quick tag over to Silas. Silas just takes out Dustin. Knocks British Kid off the apron now. Here we go. Silas Marks now setting up for his finisher. Drives Dustin Clark's face right into the mat. Here's the cover. Is this going to be enough? And that is going to end it. Oh, my God. Just out of nowhere, Society X picks up the victory here. I mean, that was crazy, man. Dustin Clark and the British Kid had control of the matchup. At least British Kid did. I think Dustin Clark let his emotions get the best of him in this matchup. Took his mind off his opponent. Gave Silas Marks the opening that he needed to rush in, catch Dustin Clark off guard, pick up the victory. back and we are now set for the tag team championship matchup as we see the main event nation second fletch tag team champions and they're going to be accompanied by mark hawkins here in this match and i'm telling you this is going to be a very high paced matchup you know we saw last week on live wire johnny J and masa haraguchi in a non-title match basically dominated the duo of Beck and fletch if that happens again here tonight, we're going to have new tag team champions. But the difference between last week and tonight is Mark Hawkins. Mark Hawkins did not accompany Beck and Fletch last week. Now Mark Hawkins is asking for a microphone here. Looks like he's got a few things he wants to say, so let's turn it over to Hawkins. God, fans, this is getting out of control.
Oh my God! Tension mounting between the main event nations. 